Tonight, the owner of a family-owned jewelry business says their store was the target of a massive burglary. As West 2's Luana Munoz reports, the owner tells us the crime happened early yesterday morning, and they need your help finding whoever did it. He cut through the ceiling, cut through two businesses, and then came in here and did this work. This wall was reinforced before the vault was installed with heavy plywood and two by fours all the way through. According to Albert Pagan, owner of the family run certified jewelry design off West 434 in Longwood, burglars entered the rooftop of the Longwood shoe repair to get to his business, where he says they stole $400,000 worth of jewelry. But now we've lost everything we ever worked for in our life savings, and we're just going to uh, keep on going and just try and start over. Bagan opened the business 13 years ago with his wife and son, building it from the ground up. There were things in there that he's been collecting ever since he started. They're like his first projects he ever made, and all like the first bracelet, the first chain, the first ring he ever made were kept safe in there, and they took that too. The family runs a tight ship. They never hired outsiders to work there and have all sorts of security, an elaborate camera system, heat sensors, and even a top of the line vault. This vault is just impenetrable to think. This was, these bars all were welded in through here and you can see where they were cut. These bars were pieces. We're not a, we're not a $10 million jeweler. Uh, and to think that, that they're still going to come even after your small you know, brick and mortar mom and pop's businesses, they, they, they just, they're, I don't know. We reached out to Longwood police to obtain a copy of the police report, but we haven't heard back from them just yet. Reporting in Longwood, Luana Munoz, WESH 2 News.